Hi, my name is Benjamin Taylor. I'm part of the Eagle Explorer FNE Troop, and I'm the Patrol Chief of the Chipmunk Patrol. I'm here to talk to you guys today about how FNE has helped me and why I would recommend it to other people. First of all, FNE has helped me grow in my virtues. It's taught me um, endurance, holiness, honesty, so many other things. Since I was a Timberwolf, FNE always pushed me to my limit. It was very challenging physically, mentally, spiritually. It opens up conversations, topics, thoughts that you would never think before. It challenges you in ways that you've never imagined before. And I never regret spending a second in FNE. I started out as a small Timberwolf. I made a video before answering a series of questions. And I've kind of slowly moved my way up. And looking back, every single second was worth it. And sometimes I wish that I could redo it, make it better. But I really love FNE. And I think that it's something that everyone should be a part of. Because I know that I'm part of something big, something beautiful, something that, that really teaches me what brotherhood really is. Something that you don't feel in school. You never feel like you're someone's brother. You don't feel that someone has your back. But in FNE, I feel such a sense of belonging and such a sense of love that I only really feel in my family. And FNE helps me grow spiritually. We go on so many different spiritual outings. We watch adoration, we go to mass, we go to confession. And it just helps me grow immensely. If it weren't for FNE, I, I don't even know where I would be right now. And it's a program that I would so recommend for any kid who's wondering what to do with himself. Parents, if you want to catch your kids away from their phone or from their TV, this is a great program. We ban all electronics during our camps and during our meetings. And it just, it's so, so worth it. It teaches you not only religious skills, but it also teaches you just practical, everyday skills, leadership, collaboration, working with others. And it's something that everyone should be a part of if they know about it. Is it fun? Is it fun? Yeah. Like, we, we play games, we just... It's, it's really well balanced. It's spiritual, it's fun, it's challenging. And you're always happy when you're in FNE. Can you describe your biggest adventure, the thing you enjoy most? I mean, you've been to many places with FNE. Oh. Can you pick one in particular or two yeah. that really come to mind? I'd say summer camp of, I think, 2015. We went for seven, eight days out into the wilderness. We cut down trees, we lashed them together um, to eat on, to cook on. And that was a camp that was particularly challenging for me. Um, it was my first camp as a patrol chief. It was my first time as a patrol chief. I found out two days before the camp that I was going to be in charge of a patrol. And it was a challenge, but it was one that I always accepted eagerly. And that camp was just so remotely different from anything that I'd ever experienced before. It was... We were far away from everywhere else. We had to dig our own toilets. We played so many fun games. We had spiritual activities. It was amazing. That would probably be my biggest adventure in FNE. You are a patrol chief. What does it mean to be a patrol chief? What are some of the responsibilities of a patrol chief? So as a patrol chief, I'm responsible for the six members of my patrol. And what that means is I'm responsible directly to them. I'm responsible for their well-being, for their safety, their health, and also for their souls. I have to guide them spiritually, physically, emotionally, mentally. I have to make sure that they stay safe, strong, and healthy, and ultimately that they make it to heaven. That's my, that's my job, pretty much. So that's a pretty big job. Is there anyone that helps you, or train you, or give you support? Always. Um, there's the leaders. Um, they're, they're here all the time. I mean, they come in for the meetings, the camps, everything. And without them, we would be completely lost. I mean, they run the program. And also priests who come in, we get to go to confession. Without confession, no one can really be a truly good leader. Um, like there was a Bible passage that said, like, how can you be a good person? Or how can you forgive other people when you are a sinner yourself? Or how can you correct other people when you yourself need correction? And without confession, we wouldn't be good leaders. We would almost be hypocrites. 
And yeah, that's always something that helps us guide other guide our patrol members. And so lastly, if um, what would you say to a boy of your age or even younger as to why he should seriously consider becoming part of FNE? Because it's different. When you're in school, you hear the same message all the time. Be cool, get a phone, get a really hot girlfriend. And FNE, everything is so amazingly different. You don't focus on being cool. There is no cool status in FNE. There's love, there's friendship, there's companionship. There's also challenge, and there is some difficulty. I mean, it's not a program for the faint-hearted. But for someone my age, I would just tell them, get off your phone, come out and have an adventure. Thank you.